Back here on EA Sports, James Sabolski along with Ray Ferraro, who's down at ice level. This should be a fun one here this evening. The Bruins have a chance to close things out. How big is that for them tonight? Well, you'd love to get through as quickly as possible. You Absolutely. get guys rested, you get guys through healthy, and you get on to the next round. Centers are lined up. Official ready to drop the puck. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. And now he moves it quickly to Berchi. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. With possession along the wall. Stays with it. Here he is in front, and that one's broken up. Great block there. Nice poke check. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Receives the pass. And a great save. The Comets will play it in their own end. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Puts it to the front of the net, and no one's blocked. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Gains the zone from the right. Good defensive stop with the poke check. And he gets a paddle on that one. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. We've got a penalty coming up on the play. I saw the hole. Did you? Yeah, so did 18,000 other people, so it's no surprise the ref got it as well. Utica sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. It's their first power play of the game. What a great chance to break this scoreless tie. Start with a face-off win. Get the puck to the point and start moving it around before you attack the net. Have a clear plan. Move to the middle! The Bruins will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. They get it out of the defensive end. Utica's got a hold of it against the wall. Pumps the puck away. The Bruins gain control of it. Puck picked up in the open ice. Nice pass. Turns it aside with the glove. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Good job tangling up his opponent here. The Comets gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice save from point blank range. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. The Comets have it from their own end. From their own end, time winding down here on this power play. They got to get something going here. Yeah, you got to get into the zone first, James. Get it set up, start moving the puck around, but they've got to get into the zone quickly. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We're still scoreless. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Delayed penalty coming up here. Providence is across the blue line. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. And the official stops the play as somebody's off to the sin bin. The Comets will serve two minutes in the box. Pretty tough to argue when you've got your hand wrapped around the guy's arm. Penalty for holding. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play, you want to make a difference. He slides the puck over. Oh, a reactionary save! And a successful clearing attempt. Handles the puck. From the point, they take control of it. Here he is from the slot. Denies him in close. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. The Comets will lose a man tripping the call. It's funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. You're kind of stuck. Providence has got a five on three and the clock's their BFF here. Five on three can really change the game. Tip it on its head by getting a couple goals on a rather lengthy power play. 
And the puck leaves the zone. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. And sends it just out of reach. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Grabs it in his own end. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Providence is on the attack. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. From in close, gives them nothing in front. Utica's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Puck clears the zone. The Bruins have it against the wall. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Strong penalty killing execution as both sides are now back to even strength. Really aggressive work by the penalty killers. They shut that power play down without any danger. Move to the middle. Here's a short pass to Bailey. And he makes the save. Again, the denial by the goaltender. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. Puck scooped up by Hamilton. On the doorstep, a chance. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Yeah, it's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Snaps one on net, steps in front of the shot. Centering pass, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Birch is gaining momentum. Great hand-eye coordination as he gets the puck back. Utica's got it behind the net. The Comet scooping up along the boards. He scores! What a shot! What a pass! The good thing he one-times this puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Comets are on the board first here. Does that change an approach now, Ray? Well, it shouldn't change it too much, but that still, you're behind, and now you chase the game a little bit. Sends the pass over. Takes the bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Fires it into the offensive zone. Moves the puck. Quick feed to Woods. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Slides it back to the blue line. Strong use of the body. Trying to get back on the attack now. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Past the midway mark in this period. We got a 1 0 game to this point. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Here they come on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Malone. Pokes the puck away. Great poise here as he gets it back. Utica's got the puck against the wall. From the place 99 made famous. Looks to make a play over to Hughes. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Centering pass! Stops him cold! Hey guys, can we take another look at that replay? Really good angle taken here as he closes him off along the boards right there. That's a big hit. The setters will glide into the dot. The Bruins win it. Takes control of the puck. Puts it on net. Oh, what an effort giving up the body there. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Utica's had outstanding stick positioning. Coaches will love to show this in the video tomorrow. won the draw. Unleashes a cannon! Denies him with the save. Not able to connect. Battle along the boards. Utica's gonna play it from the corner. Pokes it away in his own end. Takes the pass. Down the right side and into the zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Grabs control of it at the point. 
Wrister, big time glove save. Yeah, he makes a nice save here with the glove, as you mentioned, but he's able to hang on to it. That's a tough save from this position on the ice. Man, he pounded that shot, but the goalie was in good position and made the save. Well past the midway mark of this period, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. The Comets take possession off the faceoff. Puck moved over to Arsenal. Takes the feed. That pass doesn't go. Quick pass to Arsenal. Puts it up front. And he comes up with it. Can't connect. Here in the late goings of the period, the Comets have taken a 1-0 lead. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Move to the middle. Here he is in close. Steps in front of that one. Oh, what a stop. Puck picked up by Richie. And here's the pass to Carey. From the slot, wrist shot. They put it in the back of the net, and we're tied. They've worked hard for this goal to get the chance. They finally put it away. And now everything, as you mentioned, is all level. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Bruins win possession here in the open ice. Sends a pass over. Let's the wrister fly. Overshot it. Sometimes the only place you have is up over the goalie's shoulder. Sometimes you airmail it. Brilliant save. Run it perfectly. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. And a penalty coming up here as the officials all over that as they saw him slow him up. And he slides it quickly to Banks. Into the attacking area from the left side. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. And there's the whistle stopping the play. And he's going to get two for hooking on the play, Ray. He should. I mean, he gets his stick out parallel to the ice. He gets it across the player's midsection. And that's kind of a red flag for that penalty. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Hasn't been many opportunities tonight on the power play, but here is one. We'll see if they can take advantage. And he takes a shot. No, no he, he scores. He thought he had it, but it falls off him. It's in the net, and that's a goal. That's about as lucky as you can get. You need some puck luck most of the time to win. There's a good chunk of it. Utica's now up by one. What's the strategy from here on in? It's to attack. There's no defending a one goal lead with over two periods left. Go get another one. Utica grabs the puck at center. Line, Utica's got him along the wall. Bailey's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. And that carries off a stick. They go on the attack through center. Knocked away. The Comets have it now. Moves it to Berchi. And he can't hang on after that hit. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Utica's got it behind the net. In close! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Here he is, shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Denies him again. And a penalty coming up as the official blows the play dead. Tough to complain about this call holding. As soon as you slip out of position, you've got two choices. Let him go or try and slow him down. He reached out and grabbed him. He gets called. The Bruins once again send out their power play unit. 
The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Slides it to carry. From the left side, they gain the zone. On the heels of their blades, trying to get it out. And that should do it. 20 more minutes in the books. And we'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of play as the horn sounds. Looking for a way to show love for your team? Don't forget, Team Hat Giveaway Night is right around the corner. The first 3,000 fans in the arena will pick up an official Team Hat. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. And we are just moments away from the start of period number two. The Comets win the draw and get their penalty killing unit off to a good start. Excellent stick work on the play. Slides the puck across. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. Hamilton's got the puck along the wing. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Bruins will play it against the boards. Takes the feed. Snaps one from the slot. And a beautiful stop by the glove. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Good clearing attempt to breathe. And a big kill keeps the one-goal lead intact. We're back to even strength. Well, that's a missed opportunity, isn't it? A chance to tie. They don't cash in, and now we're back to five-on-five. Five. Oh, what a save in front! Utica's got the puck along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Looking for space inside the D zone. The Comets take it along the wall. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Long pass up ahead to center. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Great stick work as he pokes it away. I loved making that save in road hockey, the old blocker stop. The centermen glide into position. Steps in and takes the puck. Utica's playing it through the neutral zone. The Comets looking against the half wall. Fails to find the open man. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Providence is on the attack. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. The Comets gain possession along the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Here's a short pass to Woods. From center, they get into the attacking area. Strong defensive effort. Takes that pass back at the point. Right in the slot. That's blocked. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Malone trying to brace himself. He knows the hit's coming. But man, does he get level. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Comets lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Quick feed to Stevens. And the puck's back on his blade here at center. Wax it into the offensive zone. Receives the pass. Providence has got it along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Arsenal. Maintains possession. And we've got a two-on-one. Denied by the goaltender.
Hamilton's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Here's a chance. Utica's got a hold of it along the wall. Providence is ready to go on the attack. Utica's got the puck. Can't keep a hold of it. Gaining momentum along the wing. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Utica's gained possession along the boards. Hamilton's got it in the corner. Big play inside the defensive zone. The Bruins look to start the transition game. Nice pass. Here they are on the attack. Sends it across. Goes right to the crease. And now it's grabbed by Kemper. Utica's moving it up the ice. Bailey's got the puck. Manages to hang on. Wide of the net. You don't get the puck dead center very often. He's got to capitalize. You wonder if that'll come back to haunt them. Nice poke check. brayback has got the puck in his own zone. Sends the pass over. Make a change, make a change. Oh, smart heads up, Reed. The Comets get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Here's a chance. Misses over the net. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Richie's going to play it against the half wall. And that one's broken up. Perron's got it across the line. Shot. Wow. He scores! His first career playoff goal. He was saying to a couple guys this morning he thought he was going to be able to score soon. Looks like he's right. That's a really good shot low on the stick side. The goalie has to try and get it with his pad, and if he can't, it's very unlikely he's going to stop it. The Comets now extend their lead to two here in the second. And they've shortened the game down. You're inside the last half of the game, a two-goal lead. You've had most of the possession. You're in great shape. Puck picked up in the open ice. Couldn't connect on that pass. And now he angles it across to Perron. Takes the pass from the left wing. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Providence has got it in their own zone. The Bruins have it from the corner. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Takes the feed at center. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Steen. Slides the puck over. Oh, he'll feel that one. And that goes off a player in front. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Handles the puck. Gains the zone through the middle. The Bruins have it behind the cage. Great Reed comes up with it. Slides it across to Malone. Moves it to Arsenal. They've got the defense outnumbered. Malone's hauled down. Penalty on the way. And here comes the judgment from the official. So often in a, in a shifty little play, the, you're trying to get to the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot. He steps on your stick, and there's nothing you can do. Utica's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Here's another power play for them, James. They've already scored on the power play tonight, so they must have some pretty good feel for it. They also have to be aware the penalty killers will adjust. They will have to, too. Utica's got it against the boards. To the front! They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get the puck out of harm's way. The Comets have it behind the net. From the right side, they gain the zone. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Utica's got it from behind the net. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. From the point, looks to make something happen. 
right in the slot. Let's the wrister go. Another stop by the goaltender. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Blocker save. The replay will show us that he's in good position and makes an excellent stick save to turn away a really good scoring chance. Late goings of this period. The Comets have been getting solid offensive contributions, leading 3-1. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Great defensive stick work on the play. Picks up the puck in his own end. Now he takes it over the line. And he regains control of the puck. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind. He just doesn't execute the final pass. Passed up ahead. Here's a chance right in the slot. And that's picked off. From the left side, takes the pass. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Oh, you would have had that, Ferraro. Not really. I mean, I, I think I tried the same shot, but you don't hit the net. You don't give yourself a chance. Nothing doing on that. Utica's got a hold of it against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Regains possession at center. Jabs the puck away. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. Out to left wing and into center. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Utica's won it. Moves the puck. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Takes the pass. Cuts to the front. That goes off the stick. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Takes the feed. Period comes to an end, and lucky us, we've got one more period to go in what has been a fun one this evening. Hey, kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team, you'll have the opportunity to have a couple of our players sign autographs after the game. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. Face-off for period number three is ready to go. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Providence has been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. Into the attacking end. The Bruins have it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Camper. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. Here's a shot. Puts it high. Yeah, it sounds great. Hit the net, though. You got a better chance to score. The Comets will play the puck from behind the net. Here they come. Strong defensive effort. Sends a pass over. Utica's got control of it now from their own end. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Solid check to slow him down. Taken along the wall by Hamilton. Kemper's the victim of a hook penalty coming up. There goes the whistle. No extra attacker able to get there in time. We got a minor penalty coming up here. For sure, on this one. James. I mean, this call was going to be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're going to have to serve two minutes. Providence has got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamental is the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. He was locked in there. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. 
The Bruins will play it from the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. Takes a wrist shot, nothing doing. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Providence has got the puck along the boards. Quick feed to Carey. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a shot with the stop. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Comets are up 3-1. The Bruins will go to work here in the offensive zone. Unleashes a cannon! Scores! On the man advantage! They took advantage of the extra time available with a manpower advantage, and they're on the board. You're not aiming your deflection. You're just trying to change the direction of it. This beats the goalie because he can't catch up to the puck changing direction. The Bruins have got a big one here in the third now. Well, you got to be careful that the clock melts away fast on you, but now they've got a chance. Providence has won the draw in the neutral zone. Utica's got the puck in the defensive end. And now he tries to get it across to Banks. Utica's in transition. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Utica's got the puck against the boards. Takes the feed. Smart defensive play there. Utica's got the puck in their own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Utica's got a hold of it along the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Utica's looking to break out. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Shot to him in front. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. And now he moves it to Steen. Providence has got it across the line. The Comets take possession in the defensive end. The Bruins play it along the wing. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Stevens. Receives the pass. And that banks off a stick. Providence has got it in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Steen. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Stays with it. Sends it down low. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Comets gain possession along the wall. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Up along the wing. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Taken by Bailey. The Comets will play it in their own end. Quick pass to Merchi. Pokes it away in his own end. They've got numbers. Moves it to Hamilton. Can't connect. Providence has got the puck along the wall. The Bruins have it behind the cage. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And that's just out of reach. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. The Bruins are getting two minutes for elbowing. Looks like he's not going to make contact. And he chicken wings him and he gets nailed for elbowing. They'll go back to work on their special teams. When you've already scored on the power play and you get one now, you can't wait to get over the boards to get started again. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. Utica's gained possession along the boards. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Nice pass. Comes up with the stop.
Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. Utica's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Sends the pass over. Nice defensive robbery on that. Keeps hold of the puck. Takes the pass. Here he is on the backhand. Stones him in front. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Krajovac's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Slides the puck over. Takes the feed. No one home on that play. Trying to get back on the attack now. Battle along the boards. Providence is going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Both teams back to even strength. Impressive job by the penalty killers on that play. Well, somehow they worked their way through that last power play. The penalty killers get the job done. It's not been a very smooth night for them. The Bruins look to start the transition game. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. On the attack along the boards. Moved into the middle. A chance right in front. Turns it away. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Utica's got a hold of it against the wall. Back to the point it goes. Handles the puck. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Hangs onto the puck. The Comet scoop it up along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Utica's moving it along the wing. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice zone entry from the left. Puck battle along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Grabs the puck. It's a great way to protect the lead. Get it deep into the offensive zone and try and run around on the forecheck a little bit. Kill the clock when you can. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. And it's kicked away. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Comets have it from their own end. The Bruins ready to go on the attack. Here's a short pass to Carey. The Comets have it against the wall. Moves the puck. With some open space at center. Shot! Great save from in tight. But he came out and challenged a good save. Feeds it over to Woods. Providence has got a hold of the puck. It's a two-on-one. Here's the pass. From the point, they take control of it. Can't find his man. Jostles the puck loose. Now a quick pass to Steen. Centering pass. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. Grabbed along the board by Steen. And that sails over the net. He likes to go up there. Most times, that's maybe the only open area on the net. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Utica's got a along the wall. Tries to feed it over to Stevens. One minute left. Less than 60 seconds left in regulation. And he slides it quickly to Arsenal. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. The Comets gain possession along the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. The Bruins have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. Perron's getting two for holding. He's trying to hold him up here. Slow him down just a little bit. But you can't do that. Another man advantage opportunity looms. Can they take advantage? Off the trot, he ties up his opponent. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Providence has gained possession along the boards. Skates across the blue line. Excellent stick work on the play. Scores into the empty net. They just would not be denied. No, tonight has been their night, and with the lead, they defend it well and put it away on this empty netter.
Now that empty netter should wrap this up here. We're in the last little bit of the third period. That should be enough. Utica's added to their lead with the empty netter, and Ray, that's pretty much all she wrote, I would say. Well, you grind away to get the lead through this much of the game, and they pull the goalie, they're going to pressure you. You put it away with an easy one into the empty net. They came, they saw, they conquered. They're moving on to the next round. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. There's the final horn, and that'll do it here this evening. And with that win, they push them to the brink of elimination. This is such a critical game in a series. So pivotal. You get up three games to two. Now you got a couple of cracks to put this away. And you know your opponents are going to be feeling the pressure now. Two sets of Warriors lining up. These guys pushed each other. Uh, exhausted, tired. At the end of any long frame series, you are gassed. But one team gets to enjoy this line a lot more than the other. Well, this one's in the books. A fun one tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good night.